Good afternoon, brothers and sisters. Good afternoon, Especially Father. to F, Friend, and Thea. Let us give them a round of applause. F and Thea, it's difficult to celebrate holy matrimony in a new normal. There's an additional sacrifices on your part. And I know preparing this celebration to make it meaningful, beautiful together with your family and loved ones, you sacrifice many things along the way. Thea Jane Iglesia Laidia, or may I say, Thea Jane Idea Maronilla. Thea, thank you for being such a caring, understanding, and loving person to me. Minsa na papa isip na ako, how do I deserve such a beautiful lady like you? Kahit sobrang tigas na ng ulo ko, ikaw pa rin ang iintindi sa akin. Thea, I can promise you that I can fix your all your problems, but one thing's for sure, you will not face it alone. I know that our simple gathering now is not we planned, so bawi na lang ako sa 25th anniversary natin. F and Thea, may I now ask you to answer truthfully the following questions. Thea, did you come here today of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your husband? Yes, Father. F, did you come here today of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your wife? Yes, Father. Are you both ready to raise up as good Christians, the children whom God will give you? Yes, yes Father. You sacrifice many things. And I want to remind you, F and Thea, you will sacrifice more for the sake of your family and for the sake of your spouse. Five years I've known you, not once you've spoken the words I promise. It has always been a prove it to you. I never really understood why, but then I've come to realize it's because for you, action speaks truly louder than words. Today, I say I do, but to me, that means I will. All things that I said from the very first start of our relationship, my favorite line to you is, No promises. I will prove it to you. I love you. I love how you support me whenever I want to pursue something. I love how you push me to do things I never would have done without you. And I love that when you do, I don't feel the need to actually do it. I vow to always remind you to stop being so hard on yourself and remind you of how great you are as a person. by loving each other every day because love wins as the letter of St. Paul reminded us love never fails you will never experience failure if you will make love as your daily life as husband and wife I vow to never hurt you intentionally 
And if ever I do, promise me you'll be honest and that you'll let me know. I vow that from now on, if ever we fight, it would be us versus the problem and not me against each other. I promise you this and so much more, my love. And I live the rest of my life proving all this to you. I love you.